This is Alan Bush with the Daily Financial Forecast for Thursday, July 23rd. Stock index futures caught between the bullish influence is of better than expected earnings and the potential for more stimulus and the bearish impact of the ongoing U.S.-China trade tensions. Ultimately, though, there seems to be upward momentum for stock index futures, and I would not be surprised to see a move to higher on the day. In the currency markets, a little pressure coming into the British pound. This on the growing belief that there may not be an agreement between the UK and the European Union on Brexit. Also, the Canadian dollar a little bit higher on inflation numbers in Canada coming in stronger than anticipated. Interest rate futures markets seeing mostly higher prices. There may be some flight to quality buying coming in with the ongoing U.S.-China trade tensions. Still looks like the Fed will remain on hold at their upcoming meeting at the end of the month uh, on July 29th. The copper market seems to be in a congestion pattern, but ultimately I think copper will break out to the upside, especially once the U.S.-China trade tensions move to the back burner, hopefully. Uh, So the long-term trend on copper still appears to be higher. Silver making a new high for the move, then trading uh, lower. Ultimately, it seems that the silver market will advance longer term. Also, the gold market making some new highs. And the gold market is not so much now a hedge against inflation, but it appears to be more of a hedge against uncertainty. Technically, both gold and silver seem to be in very good shape. So both gold and silver are likely to head it higher, I think, from the current levels today and also longer term. So good trading, everyone. Once again, remember, these are my opinions alone and are not the opinions of ADMIS or ADM.